Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya Dikshit. I'm a dermatologist in private practice from the last 20 years. I work from Bangalore from my clinic, Dr. Dikshit Cosmetic Dermatology in Koramangla. Women often resort to various methods to control the amount of facial hair on their skin. And one of the common treatments which is done is facial bleaching. This process, which involves the application of a hydrogen peroxide containing cream to the skin, will reduce the appearance of dark hair by making the hair look more bleached. These treatments also are used very popularly for young women to appear fair. What happens when we apply these creams on our skin? Remember the normal pH of the skin is acidic and when we apply any product which contains hydrogen peroxide we are actually drying out the skin significantly the skin becomes dry the tight junctions of the skin are removed and because of this it is more prone to damage and early aging so most importantly avoid using facial bleach creams often if you have to use it please use it once in two to three months use it for about five to ten minutes do not exceed the time which is indicated on the product. Second, after the bleach, please use good amount of moisturizer to soothe the skin and make sure that you are using a sunscreen very regularly to make sure that the skin does not get damaged. So, bleach very often is a bad idea. It is going to damage your skin, the skin is going to get irritated, it can develop redness and it can actually get burnt. Skin use of bleach very very occasionally under a very uh, mild use is okay but remember even that is going to damage your skin. To know more about how you can actually improve the facial hair or the complexion it is better to use a sunscreen regularly and consult a dermatologist.